I want to address the use of personal devices, especially with phone use. And one of the main big issues that happens is that people overuse their thumbs and their CMC joint of their thumbs with using especially phones. And this happens because people are texting, using their thumbs, scrolling, pushing buttons with their thumbs primarily. And this starts to wear it down. Even without the use of phones these days, that um, before the use of heavy use of cell phones, people did tend to overuse their CMC joints because we do a lot of grip and pinch activities in general. So this has just accelerated the degeneration of our thumb joints, which is really bad. So ways to avoid it is instead of using your thumbs, try switching it up with your index or your middle fingers. And this will slow you down, yes, but if you learn how to do it, it won't be as slow. And it will definitely save your thumb joint and save you from having to have surgery or just having your joint fuse over time and being less mobile and therefore having less function. So using your index and your middle finger and then switching with your other hand using your index and your middle finger so that you're not overusing just one hand. And practice that over and over again and it'll start to get easier and easier each time. And then once you have it down, it's gonna be a breeze for you to keep switching it up, okay? And another huge issue that I see all the time, especially when I go past bus stations or bus stops, is people just hanging their heads, looking down at their phone. And what does that do? Especially to the spine in your neck, is that it wears down the joints and it wears down the discs in your neck. And one easy way to correct that is to bring up your personal device so that you're looking up at it. So your head can line up with your spine. And if you don't wanna look like you are you know, trying to take a picture of something or someone, you can bring it down slightly, but just remember to try and line up your head and you can look down slightly. But the best is if you can do this, this would be the best, okay? And another issue that people have is when they're using their devices on a surface like a table. So you're sitting and your device is here and people again, hang their head. So try not to do that. Instead, try to have something to prop it up. So one um, really easy tool to use is shelf liner. And let me show you how that's done. So what you wanna do is you wanna stack boxes or books on the table or even on your lap if you're sitting on the couch. And you can use a shelf liner material to help keep things in place and have the screen slightly tilted so you're not looking down, okay? And the reason why the shelf liner material is good is that it has grip and it comes in a roll when you buy it. I believe I purchased this one in Fred Meyer, but they come in rolls of just a few dollars or if you want more, um, I think they even sell at Home Depot bigger rolls for up to like 20 bucks or something like that. But I, I don't think people need that much. So just a few bucks for a small roll and then that can help you have traction on your lap or on whatever surface on binders on books that you're using to prop up your device. So here I have a piece, a small piece of shelf liner material, a small piece that I cut out for something that I found in the house. And it comes in rolls so you can cut out as big or as small a piece as you need. So here's a small piece here. And then I have a mug and I put it upside down so it has a greater base of support so it doesn't fall off easy. So I put a mug upside down and then I have my iPad here and I prop it up like that. And then you can just sit at the table and read like this. Very simple. And you can do this with an iPhone or with a um, cell phone or any kind of personal device that you use to, that you'll be viewing for a long period of time to help to help prop up so your head isn't hanging. And if you need it to be higher, then you can stack up books or boxes or anything like that to make it higher so it's better at eye level for you.